Okay, let's begin. Uh, welcome to the IoT Grand Slam. Uh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending where you're calling in from today. I'm speaking to you today as the chair of the advisory board of the Internet of Things community. We hope you, the IoT practitioner, will take home some valuable perspectives and insights that will help you develop new applications and devices and operate new networks or IoT-enabled applications. As the IoT community, we aim to have practitioners come together to network with each other and to share their best practices or perhaps some of their not-so-best practices from which we can learn some valuable lessons. The group aims to enable and facilitate discussions and work on solutions to accelerate the adoption and deployment of IoT-enabled applications, particularly in the commercial environment. We strongly believed that we need to understand the opportunities in the different vertical application segments. We seek deeply to understand the similarities and differences between these vertical segments and to bring, bring the best practices to the practitioners in the industry. As concrete initiatives to realize these objectives, we formed the LinkedIn IoT community and have organized these IoT SLAM virtual conferences. At, at the moment, we have 18,000 members in the LinkedIn IoT community. As you know, that form is great for sharing insights and for facilitating discussions, and we hope that group can remain current, active, and insightful. And we've created this series of virtual conferences to make it accessible for speakers and participants to share these best practices around the world, hopefully allowing the information to be deployed more rapidly and to more people. So we've created these IoT SLAM virtual conferences and we have been off to a good start. The first was one year ago in December 2015. Since then we had the second in April. And now we have the third, the Grand Slam, uh, today and with its partner event, the Health Slam, tomorrow. As a group, we continue to work on the challenges facing our industry um, some of them are shown here. We have many standards initiatives that need to be rationalized. Developers need guidance of what's most suitable for their IoT applications. And as this IoT community group, we intend to provide some sources of information, not necessarily the most information in the industry, but hopefully the best information in the industry. We are seeking solutions and we will value solutions that are simple and accelerate development and deployment of devices, networks, services, and applications. We need to keep it simple and moving fast. Secondly, we seek and we would value solutions that make our devices, networks, and applications safe and secure. And thirdly, we seek solutions and we would value solutions that would be cost-effectively allow us to operate, manage, and optimize and understand the users of these IoT-based applications. As I mentioned earlier and early on, we realized we have to look at the similarities and the differences in the vertical applications. The user demands and the business opportunities are different and at different stages in their development and adoption. First, let's make them vertical. And then we wanted to highlight, and our first attempt is to focus on the healthcare market as a first vertical to focus on. So we have formed an IoT health advisory group and network. If you're not already part, you're welcome to join. It's under the leadership of Chris Sullivan. Chris is the global healthcare practice lead at Zebra Technologies. He will host the Health Slam tomorrow. And he's also the chair of our Health Slam Advisory Board. So we welcome Chris to the group. And this first milestone and initiative of the Health Slam tomorrow is a very important 